Hey guys, Jonathan here with TLD with my unboxing of the fifth generation iPod Touch. Been through loops and obstacles trying to get this early for you. Bugging the hell out of Best Buy, Apple Store, and after some hard work and determination, got it a day early because they are set to go on sale at the Apple Store tomorrow. So if you guys want to go to town on that like button, it is much appreciated and let's go ahead and unbox this. I did pick up the blue 32 gigabyte model, which is $299. And they also have the 64 gigabyte model for $399. So let's go ahead and ever so carefully rip off the sticker so we can get inside and take a closer look. And there she is. So let's go ahead and take it out of its plastic, get you guys a little quick sneak peek tease close up at it. And then we're going to set it off to the side and take a look at the accessories. So we got some paper saying hello to us. That's a little boring. So let's go ahead and set that aside. And this actually may possibly replace Apple stickers as the coolest part of an unboxing, but probably not. This is the new loop connector. So as you know, the new iPod Touch has been designed for maximum funness, as uh, kind of lame as that sounds. This is going to be the little loop that attaches to the bottom of the iPod Touch so you can swing it around and have some fun with it. Next up, we have the Lightning to USB cable, and that is obviously because we no longer have the 30-pin connector on the new iPod Touch. It is replaced with the Lightning connector like we saw on the iPhone 5. We then have the EarPods, and I've actually already reviewed these, and as silly as the name sounds, they actually sound pretty good. So if you guys want to check out that review, it is annotated at the top of this video. Now that we've piled through the boring stuff, let's go ahead and power on the iPod Touch. And actually, from first impressions, it feels really, really, really solid. Like I said before, this is rocking the new 4-inch Retina display. Same resolution as the iPhone 5, 1136 by 640 and most noticeably, you'll see that extra row of icons down at the bottom. Next, I'm going to get you guys super close so you guys can see all the detail, maybe geek out a little bit. Unfortunately, the wet nap is not included. I will say I am very impressed with the display. I thought it was going to be a little lesser quality than the iPhone 5 just because you want to kind of keep some differences there, but it is actually very close from first impression. So let me know what you guys think. Are you excited for the new iPod Touch? Are you picking one up? Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss the full review, comparisons, maybe a loop demo. I don't know if you guys want that. Let me know by hitting that like button or leave me a comment down below. Aside from that, thank you guys super much for watching, and I will see you guys later.